Hi guys, you're welcome to another interesting episode of Frankly Speaking with Glory. My name is Glory Elijah. So for today's episode, I will be talking about domestic violence on men. Yes, I know that this is a topic that a lot of us avoid talking about um, because a lot of times when we hear domestic violence, the, the direction always shifts to women. Yes, women on the go or face domestic violence in their relationships, abusive relationships here and there, here and there. It's all over social media. It's all over the internet. I mean, we see videos every day. We see pictures of women with battered faces. You know, we see pictures of women, you know, crying and sharing the stories. Well, I want to say this today that men too, face domestic violence yeah and when we talk about domestic violence domestic violence is not just physical abuse there's also emotional abuse there's also mental abuse yes or if you want to say i'm wrong if you call mental abuse like let's say psychological abuse i'm not a professional in this issue right but from what i have experienced from what i have seen I can stand here and tell you guys, or rather I can sit here and tell you guys that men too undergo or face domestic violence. I'll give you a for instance. Um, I went to visit my mom, you know, and then I saw this couple sitting outside the house, you know. So the woman is quite educated. And then the husband is sort of illiterate. He's not like 100% literate per se. So he was trying to like, you know, <clears throat> blow his nose. <laughs> he was trying to blow his nose and, um, sorry guys, I don't know a name for that. So if you know the name, just comment in the comment section below. So I'll just use what I know here that we use in Lagos. So the man was trying to blow his nose and he did it. And the content in his nose thrills came out and then he used his hands to wipe his nose. And the wife just suddenly turned on to him and like, what nonsense! Arrant nonsense! That like, you, you, you cannot even use your, 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 your handkerchief to clean your, what nonsense! Like, she was literally yelling at the man, her husband, right? And then she was, mm, rubbish! You know, she was so vehement with her outburst. And I was outside, like I was being like, what's going on? Like... You know, now at that point, guys, I can assure you that that man just went through two phases of emotion of, of domestic violence. Yeah, he just went through, he just went through emotional abuse and should I say psychological abuse or mental abuse, something like that. Yes, because first of all, emotionally, his ego, his ego has been smashed to the ground, like battered, shattered, and knackered to the ground by his wife. And let's say psychologically, the woman has played on his psyche. She has made him realize or made him feel like, because I am more educated than you, I can express myself in the English language and yell at you in public. And you, on the other hand, who cannot even manage to speak proper pidgin or proper English, you cannot respond back. I feel like that was what just played itself out there, right in front of my eyes. And I felt like, wow. So let's switch roles now. If the man were to do that to his wife, you know, people out there, they'll be like, oh my God, ah, poor woman, see how the man is shouting at her. Probably used to beat her inside the house too. But now it's the... You know, now it's the woman that did it to the man. And nobody said anything. People out there on that particular day, they just turned a blind eye to it. And some of them in their hearts, even the women especially, will feel like, oh my God, that woman is a strong woman. I want to be like her. See the way she just questioned her husband. See the way she just stained the man. Ah, that woman is a lioness. Seriously, guys. Let's be realistic. I mean, let's be frank with ourselves. There are certain things that women shouldn't do to men. Women shouldn't raise their voices at their husband. Women should not talk down on their husband. Women should not yell at their husbands. I know that these are, the, these are things that we preach on a daily basis that men should not do to their wives. Yeah, everybody says, eh, men, stop yelling at your women. Talk to them, speak to them. Don't talk at them. Men, pamper your wives. Men, never you lay your hands on a woman because it is not mass um, manly. Uh, men, never you maltreat your wives. Men, don't you emotionally abuse your wife. Don't abuse your woman, blah, 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 compliment her and all of these things. But guys, seriously, if 
if we are asking men to do these for the women, I think it's only fair if we also ask women to also reciprocate the gesture to men because men too are human beings. Yeah, men too are human beings. I don't know, quote me and make it look like I am biased, but this is what I think and I feel like, frankly speaking, this is what it should be. The same measure of respect, the same measure of um, pampering, the same measure of positive energy that we expect men to met out to women I feel as well that the same measure should be given to men. Yeah, respect is reciprocal. It is a very different case when a man is mad, when a man is naturally violent, when a man has um, issues of always wanting to be violent, to beat anybody, not just women, but anybody around them. But then it is also another issue when for no reason at all, a woman just decides to be violent to a man. All because she wants to prove a point that yes, she's a strong woman. She wants to prove a point that yes, my husband is very calm and quiet. So because of that, I have to always try to be the man and the strong person or the self-opinionated person that would always want to raise her voice and tell him what to do. Please, women, let us do the right thing. If you don't want your husband to yell at you, don't yell at him. If you don't want your husband to hit you, please, when both of you are having arguments, never you hit him. Never you lay a finger on your husband. Women, if you earn more money more than your husband, or you think, or it is a fact that you are more educated than your husband, please do not rub it in. Do not kill his ego. Do not kill his manliness. Do not make him feel less of a human being, not even a man. Do not make him feel less of a human being. All because you have achieved more than what he has currently so people ladies and gentlemen whatever gender you are as usual this is my frank opinion on frankly speaking we glory Elijah so guys if you think you have anything contrary to what I have said if you feel that you have a particular experience that you want to share of when a woman is meting out domestic violence on a man please share below in the comment section and also don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel it is absolutely free guys and you are welcome to join the family and also don't forget to turn on post notification that's the transparent bell beside the subscribe button all right because when you do that you will receive a letter of my new uploads on a daily basis and don't forget to give this video a like mm -hmm, and share to your friends and loved ones till next time thanks for watching bye